Okay, hello. I'm Miss Lena from Miss Lena's Kitchen. Today I'm getting ready to do uh, a, a, a salmon square. And uh, I'm doing the, the orange pepper salmon square. Okay, and I've already got my salmon cut up in squares. Okay, so now I'm going to show you the ingredients that I'll be putting in it. So I'm only going to be using, okay, I'll be using my uh, Louisiana fish fry, okay? And I'll be also using the, the orange pepper. I'll be using my granulated garlic and the granulated onion. So now I will be pouring it in to my bag with the, with the uh, fish fry, okay? So, all right, this is the garlic, I'll pour it in. I don't have that much, and so I'm just, it doesn't take a lot. I'm just going to season it according. And I, if you're going to make it, you just have to season it according to what you have. Okay? So now I'm putting in my onion. Okay? And after I do that, I'll be putting in my pepper, my red, my uh, orange pepper. And now I'm going to be shaking it up. Okay. And today I'm not using a deep fryer, but I'm deep frying it in the pot on the stove because I don't have that much to put in. Okay. So now I'm going to put this, I'm shaking it up so I can get it mixed up. And then I'll be putting, I'll be putting into the egg batter which I have one egg and a little milk, just to, enough to put it in the egg batter, okay? All right, so I'm gonna be putting that back, and I'll be, um, let me put my glove on, and I'll be putting it in the egg batter, and then I'll be dropping it into the grease. And my grease is already ready, just about for, it's ready to, for it to be in. And it only takes just a few seconds uh, maybe a four or five minutes to turn it over because it doesn't take long for salmon to cook. So I'm going to drop this in to my batter. And then after I take it out of the batter, I'll be putting it into the meal bag. Okay. Okay. So I'll be putting it in. I'll be putting it into the batter. Sorry about that. It's my great niece running y'all here. Okay, I'm putting just a little bit more orange pepper on it. And as I put it in the skillet, I'll be putting a little bit more orange pepper on them. Okay. They, have, they probably have enough orange pepper because I don't have that many. So I probably won't have to put it. I thought I might would, but I don't think I'll have to because I don't have them. I don't have that much. And I don't want to put too much on it. Okay. Okay, now I'm getting ready to shake the uh, off a little bit so I can drop them into the skillet, okay? All right. And my grease is already ready. Okay. She just took two salmons and she just took two salmons and two cut them and cut them up to squares. Two slices of salmon. Okay. Okay. Now they're all in the grease. Ready to go. Alright. Now I'll be taking my gloves off. And and she'll be turning them over just a little bit. She'll be back when she's re ready to turn them over. Okay, I'm turning it over now. Okay. And they're coming out golden brown. And yeah, they'll be ready to come out in about one minute or so. And you turn all of them over and just let them. Because I've already cooked pretty well. Okay. And these will be my salmon squares.
Should be back. They're almost done. Don't take time and they're long to cook. Okay. I'm getting ready to take them out now. Okay. They are very pretty and brown. Okay. So, on both sides, that's what they are already. Oh, they're really crispy and everything. So, now you see. These are my... Uh, Orange pepper, salmon, and so they are, they are very pretty and brown, and this is all of them, because I only had two at the start with. So now, I'm going to make uh, the tartar sauce in a little bit, and I'll be back when I get the tartar sauce made. Okay, I'm now getting ready to make homemade tartar sauce. So, I already have my salmon already. But I'm going to do the homemade tartar uh, uh, sauce. So I'm using two, t I don't have that many, uh, that much uh, uh, pepper salmon squares. So I don't have to use very much uh, to make the uh, tartar sauce out of. So I'm using only two tablespoons of uh, Helma mayonnaise. Okay, that's one. And this is two, okay. 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 And I'm going to pour just a little bit of lemon juice in it. Just a tiny bit. I don't have that much. Maybe three, just three or four drops, okay? And I'm going to put just a little bit of garlic powder. Okay. And a little bit of onion powder. Okay. And I'm also putting in sweet radishes, okay? And I'm only going to put in just a tiny bit of the sweet radishes. Okay. I don't need the juice in them, so I'm trying to let it drain. as much as I can. Sometimes it takes a little longer for them to drain. So as it drain, okay, this might be enough. Okay, I'm gonna stir it up. And I'm also gonna put my chopped onions in. They have already been chopped, okay? Now this is for the tartar sauce, okay? All right. So I'm just going to go ahead and stir it up here. And you can, this is what you call the homemade, your homemade tartar sauce. Now you can use more if you, if you have something else that you want more. But I only have maybe like seven or eight squares. And so that was all that I was putting in just to make a little bit. So now you see what the tartar sauce looks like. Okay. And I'm going to bring the, uh, let me get my, uh, Salmon squares and going to uh, uh, a taste test with the with the uh, with my salmon and my uh, tartar sauce. So this is what it looks like. Okay. Oh, it's delicious. Mhm. Mm Okay. Well, okay, I'm going to do a taste. Very, very good. Mmm, it's good. And I hope you'll try the orange, uh, orange pepper salmon plus the uh, tartar sauce. I was just great together. And it will be because it will be homemade tartar sauce that you'll have. So, this is from Miss Lena's Kitchen. And I sure thank you for looking and for viewing today. And I also would like to say, 
I thank you for all of my viewers. And I thank you for all my old subscribers. And I also thank you for I also thank you for my old for um my uh new subscribers and I thank you for just watching and keep viewing uh from time to time because I'm gonna be doing a lot of videos. So stay tuned and when your notification bell rings you'll know that I'm coming on. Tune me in because sometimes I'm gonna do some live I'm gonna do some live sessions in it uh, pretty soon. But I sure thank you for tuning in for my uh, salmon video for tonight. Thank you. Love you all. Appreciate you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye. See you later. Bye. Hit the mic, Jackson Bell.